If you guys are in need of some coins to get that player or team you've always wanted, make sure to check out Mutt's store and use code TD for 10% off. Give me a random position in football. A random position? First one that comes to your head. Right guard. Right guard? All right, that's actually all I needed. There you guys have it. Out goes TJ Lang. In comes O'Day. I'm not even gonna attempt to pronounce his last name. And I know all of you guys are gonna be asking, TD, where's London? She has to play the first quarter for you. She's actually at school right now, not because she's a freshman, she's actually a senior. A senior in college, I should probably point that part out as well. Those comments are actually out of control. I literally have to delete some of them because they just look so bad. The crazy thing about all of that is that was like a joke I made like a year and a half ago and it's still going. Like, it's such a long-lasting thing that just won't go away. I'm thinking London playing will 100% be in the next episode, which if we win today, we get a first round bye. So that means she'd be playing the first quarter of our playoff game. Anyways, guys, welcome back to Road to the Super Bowl. This series has been amazing so far. You guys have been showing so much support. Every single episode I've posted has made it to trending on gaming. And in fact, the last one got up to like number 15. If you guys can keep hitting that like goal, I will just bring the next episode out probably tomorrow. I'm not really sure where this came from, but we have a two elite player pack bundle. Let's just speed through the second pack and we actually got, oh, we got Rashawn Melvin, 88 overall cornerback. We actually used Melvin a little bit over the summer in Madden 18. He was actually so good for us. He's not like great at anything, but he's also bad at nothing. Now in that last gameplay, which if you guys missed it, make sure you check it out. It literally came down to the final play, but we end up earning 5,690 points. Now I'm just gonna bump it up like 200 so we can open up the seven times playoff bundle. First pack, what do we got out of here? We are getting a center, Ryan Kelly, 88 overall. I guess there's some new playoff cards in packs. All of them were only like 90 to 91 overall, which is kind of weird. You'd think they would want to add some bangers like 93s, 94s, 95s. But I mean, in a series like this, like a 90 or 91 overall player would help us. I'm not turning it down. It's going to be the final card, 84 Kendall Lamb. Ooh, that looks like a bigger flare. Just kidding, it's Corey Graham. This was actually the last Last pack. Hopefully it's not the only playoff card. I have a feeling it's gonna be. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's one of those. Yeah, it's a harvest player. Those packs are actually a little bit disappointing. So Ryan Kelly, who we got in the first pack, that's actually the only player that's gonna be starting for us. And then over on defense, we actually got him out of those free elite packs with Sean Melvin. I might have to move the secondary around a little bit. Jesse Bates has been so good at cornerback. So I don't want to move him back to safety but we might be better off starting Melvin on the outside, moving Bates to maybe free safety and Hopkins to strong safety. I don't know, we'll see. Oh, uh, just getting some pre-game stretches in. You know, really gotta get those fingers loose for them wiggle sticks. I kind of have to pee right now, but I don't really want to get up. Do you guys ever feel that way too? That's actually a pretty unique top three. Well, not Michael Vick, but the other two guys. Do you guys see what I see? Over on the right, now it's over on your left. That is the wild card symbol painted on the field. That means this guy's in the playoffs. We can ruin his season. Oh man. This guy's got speed everywhere. He's starting off with the inside zone. Come on, gotta shut down Kamara. I don't know if you guys watched my draft video from yesterday. I went with James White, who was number 28. I was doing the lowest jersey number draft. Everyone was saying I should have picked Kamara. You guys can see it. He's actually number 41. I got the middle locked up. He's gonna go left side, going underneath. That is a great tackle by Hopkins. That's supposed to be his weakness, but he does a really good job of it. Third and five, gotta keep Vic in the pocket. Oh, watch the middle, watch the middle. That's where he's going. What a play, I believe. That was Roquan Smith that made that. He's gonna go for it. He's actually going five wide, watch the middle. Oh, he's going right side. He was wide open. I was feeling so good up to that point, and then that happens. Now we just gotta lock in. I got Kamara on the right side. That's actually where he's going. Oh, we got it off the tip. That's Williamson. How many times in the series have we seen an interception off the tip? It feels like it's every episode. Time to see what our right guard can do. I'm actually scared, man. I don't know what to expect. Oh, why was I watching him? I need not worry about the offensive line. I just need to make the right reads. Let's go, uh, oh yeah, we're gonna go right as user. Randy Moss, come on. We're actually gonna get the first down. Let me just take off a of Mayfield. We're gonna get a block on the outside. I tried chucking Willie McGinnis. I don't know why I thought that was smart. It actually almost worked. Oh yeah, right there, he's wide open. Randy Moss again. This guy is just exposing his secondary. Someone's gonna be open. Oh no, I didn't mean to lob it to Robinson. It ended up getting intercepted. 
I literally, I tried hitting bullet pass. You guys can even back me up on that one, because you see me run that route a lot, and I always go with the bullet pass. I never lob it. Oh, he's going left side. That's in traffic. Bates is going to get it right back. Let's go. Oh, he brought a blitz. Lindsay, thank you for picking that up. You just saved Baker Mayfield's. Oh, he fumbled. Wow. A game of turnovers. In the first quarter, four turnovers. Wow, Michael Vick just got destroyed. Defense has been going off. Third and 17. He's actually going to go underneath. He's probably going to go for this. Fourth and 12. Come on, D. Just keep doing what you're doing. Oh, yeah. We got tons of pressure. He's going down. We just got to settle down. Get some points on the board. If we just get rid of the dumb turnovers, we are in perfect position. Oh, come on, Lindsay. He is so fast. This guy cannot stop him. Look at that spin move. Come on. Keep running. He's finally going to get caught all the way at the 7. Yeah, I think that was definitely the right guard that just got beat. So we're going to throw it away. I just don't want to force anything here. We might have had him for a second. We're going to go underneath. He's going to make the tackle. We just got to get some points on the board. I know it's kind of boring. We maybe should have went for it. But I feel like a field goal is big because this guy really hasn't shown me that much on offense. He's going to try and run with Vic again. Oh, we got to strip that loose. This is going to be the last play before the 2-minute warning. He's going to try running our defense is on another level right now man he can't do anything we know this play we see it all the time we got the middle covered he's uh he's gonna throw across his body oh tyreek hill just broke us that kind of hurt my ankle i even felt that one i know he picked it up but that's still a good sign that he had to do that much just to get one first down the only problem is that is the second fourth down we've given up oh yeah we got that let's go roquan smith that was like a 360 interception and we might bring this back Okay, never mind. Michael Vick is extremely fast, but we are inside the 20. This is normally something I don't do. Let me just settle down and run the ball. I should probably do this more, especially with Lindsey. Okay, that blocking was kind of weird, but he turned it into a touchdown. This guy is too good. I know you guys saw that. It looked like my player was going to pick up the outside defender, but then he just kind of turned back and was like, nope, never mind. Undefeated season is starting to look good. We're going up 10-0, and we get the ball in the second half. Oh, wow. He actually caught that. No way. That's the break he needed. Tyreek's in space just making us look stupid. He's down at the 11. I swear that went through DeMarcus Ware's hand. I can't wait to see the replay of that. Dang, man. That changes everything. Come on, boys. We got to lock down. Watch the middle. He's going to try and run with Vic. He's going to end up sliding at the three. He's not actually going to run it. It's a little bit surprising. Oh, we're all over him. He barely got that one away. Besides that, oh, it's a fake. Come on, we got to have this wrapped up. Oh, it's going to be picked off. Let's go. We might have a return here. Um, oh, I couldn't. Oh, I was hitting it. We're just going to run this right up the middle. Oh, let's go. Oh, Lindsay, he's still on his feet. If he could have got through there, we would have been looking at a 90-plus yard touchdown. He's going to bring another blitz. Come on, we got to pick that up. Let's. Oh, let's go deep. Let's just toss it up, man. That's Allen Robinson. Oh, he dropped it. We got third and two. He's going to bring another blitz. I'm actually just going to take a shot because he is wide open. What? I have been saving that play, and I feel like I saved it for the perfect time. Just for the ball to go... Okay, just bounced off Tyreek's back. But just for the ball to go right through Allen Robinson's hands. I'm feeling confident, man. I feel like we are in complete control. If we somehow choke this... This might be a little bit risky. Fourth and five. We're going to go for it, man. Why not? Let's go... Uh, uh, we're going to high point it. That's Randy Moss. That's just too easy. You know he's going to go up and get it every single time. Oh, wow. He just, yeah, he's out of here. He just quit out of his own playoff game. Down 10-0. There's that. We end up earning a first round bye in our first season. Two more wins, and we're in the Super Bowl. I know it seems like this is going by pretty quickly, and we're already up to an 87 overall. You guys got to remember, we are currently doing this around Baker Mayfield, who's a quarterback, and that's like the easiest way to get points. Once we win the Super Bowl and we do this around a different player, like let's just say I do a free safety, it's going to be a lot more slow moving because you got to remember a free safety, he might not actually do something every single game. I just kind of wanted to clear that up because some people are like, yo, TD, your team is getting way too good, way too fast. Don't worry. Once we do this around other positions, it's going to be a lot Lot more slow going that is gonna be it for the episode though hopefully you guys did enjoy be sure to leave a like if you're ready for the next episode that is gonna be crazy london is gonna be playing the first quarter of our playoff game and let me tell you she does not know what she's doing that's not a diss i'm just being real about it make sure you guys are subscribed if you're new around here i don't want you missing any single videos i have been posting every single day i want to say this is like number eight or nine and i don't plan on stopping anytime soon so hopefully you guys have been enjoying and until next time i will see you later peace out